What's up everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to explore an essential aspect of email marketing and that is how to change the sender email in MailChimp. Customizing your sender email is crucial for branding and ensuring your emails are easily recognizable by your subscribers. Now before we jump into the action, if you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest adventures and it keeps you on the loop for future content. And to our returning viewers, welcome back and we appreciate your ongoing support and cannot wait to embark on this journey with all of you once again here. Now let's get right into changing the sender email in MailChimp. It's important for several reasons as it directly impacts on how your email campaigns are received and perceived by your subscribers, right? So a customized sender email address appears um, from a familiar domain, right? So basically what will happen is it can positively influence subscribers' perception of your branded emails. Uh, custom sender emails are typically associated with repeatable businesses. So changing the sender email to what aligns with their brand and improves your email uh, credibility and reduces the likelihood of being flagged as spam. Subscribers are more likely to open emails from a sender uh, they recognize, right? Who wouldn't want that, right? Using a custom sender email encourages recognition and trust, which can lead to higher open rates. Now, personalization custom sender can include a recognizable name, which adds a personal touch to your emails. Subscribers may be more inclined to engage with content from a known individual within your organization. Email delivery while changing your sender email can improve that ISPs are more likely to deliver emails from recognized and verified sender addresses to recipients in boxes rather than spamming marking them as spam, right? So in hindsight, generic or unbranded sender emails can trigger spam filters. Changing to a custom sender email reduces the chances of your emails being mistakenly filtered as spam, right? And when subscribers receive emails from a sender they trust, they're more likely to engage with the content, click on links, you know, and take desired actions. This can lead to a higher conversion rates, and they allow you to accurately test email content, you know, subject lines, and other elements without the influence of generic sender addresses. Now, when you go to the dashboard, all you got to do is go to your profile. Some some version of the, the, they can see your profile here at the bottom left. But on my end, since I'm using a different one, you can go here in the profile here and check. Uh, it's either you go to the account settings or your profile would be enough. It'll take a little bit. But once it's loaded, okay, now it's loaded. All you got to do is uh, change this email, for example. At YouTube. MailChimp.com. How cool is that? It's very easy, simple. Just gonna watch uh, this video for the walkthrough, and that's a wrap for today's tutorial on changing um, the email sender. If you found this tutorial helpful, please subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up. And let us know in the comments if you have like you know any questions. Or if there are MailChimp topics you'd like us to cover in our future videos, that would be nice. And I'd like to make a few shoutouts to our loyal subscribers who are relentlessly sharing our links to their friends, family, and colleagues. You, you are the reason why we're doing these videos. And it keeps our small community bigger every single day. And thank you for watching. I'm pretty sure that I'm going to be seeing you in the next video. And... I'd like to also make a short a shout out to our sponsor for today's video. And yeah, that's it. Thank you so much, guys. See you in the next vid.
face.